Hello, my name is Zornica, and in this video I'm going to show you how to configure Elastic Email with Wireclass. So how to integrate Elastic Email into your website? Let's begin with what is an Elastic Email. So basically, companies are looking to communicate with customers without breaking the bank and look to Elastic Email for some help. It's a scalable, flexible, and with an open API that can be set up in minutes. It provides email marketing tools that are reliable and cost-effective. It doesn't matter what is the reason for you to seek Elastic Email, but the main benefits are that you get a set of tools that can handle email campaigns, big or small. Direct email sending is also made possible. So Elastic Email is a user-friendly, reliable, top-notch performance. All right, so with Elastic Email, business can easily build email marketing strategies and create emails that will engage subscribers. So without further ado, let me show you how to create an Elastic Email account and then how to integrate it into your website. So I'm going to go to my admin panel from over here, settings and email settings. Now you have the email configuration and the general email configuration needs uh, to enable the email service. After you enable the Elastic Email service, you save the changes and you go to Elastic Email. From over here, you can click on sign up Elastic Email for free and register on the website. So if you click on the link, it takes you to elasticemail.com where you can create an account. I've already created my account. And from over here, I'm going to show you how to create an API key. So if you go to verify domain, you just have to go to API and from over here, just have to click on uh, create. It shows like that, but basically uh, you just need to create one. Over here you get a box that says create new. As you can see here, it says add additional credit materials. You have to copy your API key from over here. All right. And then you have to go back to your admin panel and paste it over here. Then you have to save the changes. So then you can send a test email to see if it actually works. But of course, you will be notified that you successfully added it before that. When you go to your Elastic email, if you want to add contacts from over here, you can click on Upload Contacts and from Manage Contacts, you can add and upload contacts. You can create a list or add single contact. Basically, you can enable subscription management and more. You can find out more on our documentation at Y class. Basically, that's all you need to do to configure the Elastic Email into your website. Thank you for watching the video and I hope it was helpful.